Sub-Zero's corner combos are super important, not only because it gives you extremely high damage, but it makes him one of the scariest mix-up characters in the game. 53% on that combo and you can definitely hit this one in real matches. So the hardest part of this combo is actually probably hitting this standing two follow up. Sadly, there isn't really a trick to it. The best thing I could say is try and do it as late as possible. Try to actually let them fall down a little bit before you hit that standing two. Otherwise, you're just gonna whiff right in their face. So for the next part of the combo, you wanna try and hit this follow up jumping on the way down into standing four. You can hit the jumping on the way up, but it's not really gonna give you that same follow up. So you can see I did standing four, but there's no way I'm getting the one two follow up there. So once you get to the jumping, just take your time. Make sure you're actually doing it on the way down. Standing four, one two, jump two again, on the way down once again into the KB. The final part of this combo is actually super easy. Once you get there, you're pretty much never going to drop it. If you get the second launcher, it's just a jump in again on the way down, 1, 2, 4, KB. As long as you're hitting those jump twos on the way down, you should be able to hit this combo pretty consistently at that point. You can also get the full combo from the overhead. It's pretty much the exact same thing. Rising ice, jump two, 1, 2, 4. Everything's pretty much the exact same. 48% damage from the overhead and 53% damage from the low. That is why you need to learn these combos. That's pretty much all for the guide today, but I'll give you a few extra Sub-Zero combos if you do want to learn this character a little bit more. <laughs> okay, that one's pretty much never going to happen in a real match. So don't really worry about going for this combo, but I just wanted to show you guys the damage. There we go, 75% on that combo. That's the end of the Sub-Zero combo guide. I hope this helps you out. If you're still struggling to hit these combos after watching the video, just let me know in the comments what you're having trouble with. I'll try my best to help you out as much as I can in the comments. If you want to see some high-level Mortal Kombat, check out one of these videos right here. Let me know in the comments which character I should make a combo guide with next. Thanks for watching this quick combo guide, and I'll see you on the main channel.